Happy Easter, everybody. Wanted to do a video on fry today. This tank is Fenestratus fry. It's a 110. Preview, well, it's drilled and I uh, capped off the holes with uh, bulkhead fittings and PVC caps threaded into the back. It's fairly clean looking. So these are Fenestratus fry. Had the pair of Fenestratus in here for a couple of weeks and they bonded up, spawned. Um, in about the second or third week of these fry being free swimming, the male uh, hammered the female pretty bad, so I put a divider in the tank. Uh, she recovered. She kind of had a cloudy eye, but she still had vision. She reacted from that side, uh, so I could tell she could see. And I came home from work one day, and she had jumped over the divider, and the male got her and, and killed her. So then I kept the male with the fry. The fry ended up just harassing the dad, the male, so much that I had to remove him from the tank. So here are the fry in the 110, Fenestratus. Uh, they've got a pink mom and they've got a half pink dad. I'll show you the dad, he's over here. So he's isolated in this 135, which has made everybody in here a little bit more active. But anyways, back to fry. All right. So in this tank is my pair of ah, Red Tiger Motos, Paracromus Motoguents. This is their first spawn together. I've had the female for a while. Got the male recently from Jack Daniels here in... Daniels, excuse me, in uh, Kansas City. They're pretty skittish, and I just went through and I cleaned glass so I could do the video. You can see the female back there. But fry. So there you go. There's a little bit of there. They are in a 75. Here's the male. They'll be going into a uh, 110 or 135 here before too long. Below them are some Tanganyikans, Neolamprologus multifasciatus. They're in a 20 long. We'll see if we can see some of their fry. I'm not seeing any, but there's a bunch in here. Back to fry. Got my trusty pair of Cuban cichlids. Got from Dylan Clevenitz. So they got some fry. They're above the uh, Fenestratus. Got some uh, Managuense fry. They're in kind of a dark tank. But there's probably a dozen left I need to sell off. Over here, I've got a six pack of 29 gallons that I use for fry rearing. These are Cubans from the previous pair. More Cubans from a more recent spawn from the same pair. Got my pair of Honduran 
red point convicts. And here, uh, I'll go upstairs and show you their fry. Their fry have much more apparent red on their fins. So they're sitting on a decent tank full of fry. Um, from Cichlid of the Americas, got some bean eye. I ordered four. Um, it said inch and a half to two inch. They came in about an inch, inch and a quarter. I'm assuming they gave me seven to make up or to compensate for the small size. But they are just a, a very inquisitive, curious fish. Pretty rare in the hobby right now. I hope to raise some up. Hopefully get a pair out of this group. Maybe a couple of pairs. Next to them, Alto Lamprologus Calvus Black. These fry are a year and a half, year and four months. Uh, this way I've got a, another 110 with the Paramedic Wednesdays Wild Cop Male in the Dirty Glass. So he's a wildcat male, but the female's a Florida female. They've got a couple of fry. Got a little half partition. So he can go over to the other side. And here's a bunch of Bradori. There's a Petrochromus, some Trophius, a Lepidolamprologus mealy. Mealy, however you want to call it. Mealy. Uh, Yep, and they just spawned over there. Uh, over here, last fry for downstairs are the Festes. I'll let her come out. She's Best day. All right, so I typically don't show my face, but there I am. I'm going to take you upstairs. It's probably dark here for a minute. And so in this tank, Some more Cichlid of the Americas, uh, Vieja Melanura, and these Honduran Red Point convicts are the fry of the pair downstairs. I think there's about eight of them in this tank. A young pair of Cubans, one of which is mine, the female. So the suspected female is from my pair. That's the male that I got at Pet World Lawrence. There you can see the the red coming out on those convicts. This Maniguense is the only fry of the wild caught pair both male and female so we'll see what that fish turns out to be Mel and Nora are looking good anyways hope everybody had a great Easter talk to you later